look at how to install IFC OpenShell in our computer so that we can run it through a console or an IDE. So the, the steps are fairly simple. We first need to download the relevant folders or files and then put them in the Python installation path. So to download your IFC OpenShell folders, you could do it in different ways. So my preferred method is to use Blender Vim because it already contains everything. So if you go to IFC OpenShell GitHub and go to releases and click on Blender Vim and grab yourself the relevant version you need. I needed Python 39 from Windows. This is therefore what I downloaded. It's right here. So let's open it up. When you click on libs site packages, you should then find IFC 4D, IFC 5D, IFC OpenShell. You can also find Kobe and get maintainable assets. You can also find IFC CSV. Let's copy all of these and then go to Python 39 or Python 38, depending on what you have. Then libs, oops, no, lib, site packages, and paste all of those in here. Great. Now, if you go to an IDE, or a console for that matter, you can type in Python, import IFC open shell, and it works, import IFC open shell API, okay, import IFC 4D, import IFC 5D, import IFC CSV, and if that didn't work, then you may need to install um, other packages and probably lark. So just go and do pip install lark or whatever else you may be missing to run those uh, modules. Another way to, to get those folders is through the IFC open bug. You will land on this page and in here go to the version 0.70 branch and on the latest commit, if you see a message like that, then scroll all the way down and download the relevant build. I'll also put this link in the comments so that we can keep it here as a record. So let's get Python 38 and that's what I have right here. Within Python 38, what you find is only the API and that's a problem. Why? Because you don't have the other modules that we need like IFC 4D, IFC CSV, etc. And to fix that, what you could do is uh, go back to IFC Open Shell, get your link here and clone it somewhere. Get clone. I already have IFC Open Shell somewhere. So I'll open it up. And within IFC Open Shell, and source, you'll find IFC 4D, IFC 5D, IFC Kobe, IFC CSV, and a bunch of other utilities that may come in handy someday. This time, I'm doing it for my Python 38 version. I'll drop IFC Open Shell in here, and IFC CSV, IFC 5D, IFC. This should also run for any Python 38 uh, projects.